This is a test at the maximum settings using OBS in a normal Minecraft world. Yo guys, what's up? This is Yeti, and today I'm going to be showing you guys my OBS um, settings for Minecraft or just a normal desktop recording um, video. So yeah, let's go ahead and start. So basically, OBS is what I record with on my computer. I get um, decent FPS with it. Actually, I don't even get any FPS drop when I record with Minecraft. So I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys a quick video on my settings. So first of all, of course, if you guys don't have uh, OBS or Open Broadcast Software, just go to the link down below and download it um, for Windows 7, 8, 10, or um, Mac, Linux, whatever. Just download it, install it, and then once you open it, I'm just going to go ahead and explain basically a few things. So over here is your settings tab. I'm recording right now, so as you can see, I'm recording. Um, it'll show my screen. Oh wow, that's weird. Okay, but yeah. Um, exit is to exit it. Preview stream is like if you're, uh, if you want to preview um, what something will be recorded and like what is actually going to be recording, you can preview it. Um, stop recording. Start record. Stop recording. Stop. Pre start recording sorry about that um but i usually just use hotkeys for that uh my audio to hear what i'm listening to but right now i'm not listening to anything so there's nothing um coming like my microphone tab settings edit scene is um for your sources if you have something and you want to move it around or something i'll explain that um don't know what exactly what this is and this is your plugins so let's go ahead and just start from the settings tab so first of all, in encoding, if you have, if you want to have 1920 by 1080p, 60 FPS, best quality possible, um, it may be a decent file size. But if you want that, um, these are going to be the settings for you guys. If you guys want me to make another video just for 720p, decent quality, then I'll do that. But you could probably figure it out yourself. But yeah. So guys, first of all, if you do not have an NVIDIA graphics card, you may get FPS lag, I'm not sure, because whenever I had uh, my old graphics card, I didn't have the choice of using this right here, so it actually lags really bad, so I'm sorry if this doesn't work for you guys, um, there's plenty of other recorder softwares out there. But, yeah, so if you guys do have an NVIDIA card, make sure to tick this box. If you don't, you can still tick this, but you might get some lag. So I suggest to turn the bitrate down, which I'll explain in a second. So the max bitrate for me is 50,000, and that is the best quality. That'll make it the best quality possible. You, of course, want to use CBR, but if you, um, to change the quality balance, just untick this, change it to 10, and then you CBR again. You don't have to tick any of these, and then this will already be fifty thousand. Because if I were to make this five thousand, it changes with it. You see, right here, make your bitrate one ninety two, um, stereo forty eight hertz, and AAC codec. I'm not gonna apply any of these settings because I don't need to. It's the same, right? Yeah. Okay. Good. Um, broadcast settings. You want to make it file output only. To find your file output, just click on browse. And I'd make a separate folder. That's what I have under my YouTube upload folder. Um, so just go to desktop and then make a new folder, search it, and then save it. But I'm not going to do that. So I'm not going to apply these settings. Um, under video, of course, you want to select your graphics card. Hey, one sec, guys. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, so yeah, you just want to select your graphics card. Make the custom resolution 1920 by 1080 right here. Um, make sure it's on custom. And if you guys um, don't have a 1920 by 1080 monitor, just go to display settings. Right click your desktop to figure it out if you don't know. For Windows 10, it's under advanced. You'll be able to find it. And it'll tell you what your resolution is right here. Um, so just set it to whatever your resolution is, of course. Um, keep the aspect ratio night or 16 colon 9 uh, resolution downscale make it nothing and make the FPS 60 to make it the best possible quality um, under audio I just have my speakers that's basically my headphones my microphone the blue snowball right here um, make sure that this is at 200 and then 2 and 2 right here um, you don't have to do anything else here 
under hotkeys i suggest doing this definitely um just click on something and then press the key on your keyboard um to start and stop it um yeah so just click on that and let's say we wanted to make it i don't want to really click anything because i might mess up the recording let's say i wanted to make it like you or something i do that and then i'd also make this you so you to start and you to stop like that and then i'd click apply but i'm not going to do that so i'm going to click no go back okay um and then for streaming of course i'll make another video for that if you guys want just leave a comment below if you do want that um that's a different hotkey um under here um make sure to use multi-threaded a optimizations um put it on normal 700 you don't have to take any of these under video make it high quality um main um keyframe interval for two use cfr is ticked nothing here um and then these are all the default settings down below um and then yeah that's really everything that you should have right here so you just want to click ok and now you got you guys got your settings but you probably don't have anything under your sources unless you already have OBS. So I'm going to explain how to do that right now. So if you want to record, let's say Minecraft, you'd want to go to Add and then Game Capture right here. And then I'd name it Minecraft, but I'm just going to do YT Test or something for YouTube. And then what you would want to do is select the application. But since I don't have Minecraft open, which we can go open it right now. Give me a second. I'm just going to open it. Um... It should load up if we click the refresh button. There it is. But you actually probably will have to open Minecraft up. So open up Minecraft. Then click the refresh. Then look for the Minecraft. Um, whatever version it is. And then just select that. And then click OK. And then whenever you go into Minecraft in full screen. And click that hotkey that you set. It'll record. And then all I have to do is click it again. And it'll... Um, stop it and then you got your video for youtube just edit it all that good stuff um so if you want to do monitor capture it's under add uh monitor capture of course just name it whatever you want and it you don't really have to do any settings under there but actually you might yeah you do okay so monitor one i only have one monitor so i don't have to do that if you guys have multiple monitors like to the left or right or whatever just select that you can turn the brightness up on any recording but i'm not gonna do that um, so I'm just going to cancel. Uh, if you guys want to add a face cam, just go to add. And then t -t -t video capture device. Let's say you want to have a face cam. Um, my team can do that. Um, you'd want to select your face cam. I have a phone and I use Epicam because I'm ghetto like that. Uh, so I'd select this. Um, if you guys want to make a green, if you have a green screen or something, I should say you somehow do. Um, if you do, you'd want to use chroma key. And then what you'd want to do is select um, the green that will be behind you. So you want to have your like face cam preview thing up. Um, and then you want to select the green behind you. And then you'd have a green screen, but I'm not going to do that. So cancel all that out. Um, so yeah, that's basically the main things. Um, of course, you can add text to the screen if you want. like Maybe like a server IP or something. Um, just go uh, and then click OK. There it is right there. Um, if you do want to edit the scene, which I don't think I can do because I have a recording going on right now. I'm just going to turn that off though. I'd probably want to, um, if I want to edit it, I'd probably um, want to stop and then edit it. I'm not sure if you could do it during the recording. I'm not going to try. And if you want to fix the text or something, just double click. It'll take you right back in. You change the... You can add outline, change the color, all that good stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and delete that real quick. Yes. Okay. And now we are all set, guys. So it is pretty much that simple. Um, when you get into Minecraft or whatever game you're recording, you can record this with any game, by the way. That's what makes OBS so good. And OBS is also free, which is amazing as well. Um, once you get into whatever game you're going to <clears throat> want to record it won't tell you any fps or anything but with an nvidia card you shouldn't lose any fps with normal you might lose a few but not too much hopefully um so yeah so basically it won't tell you that it'll just like do a little like lag thing when you start and then just click it the hotkey to stop and it's that simple so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed be sure to leave a like on this video and of course subscribe and that's about it i'll see you guys in the next one have a great day take care
Tell me that you love me, 